What's up everyone? So today I'm going to show you how to actually do some headphones in Vroy Studio. First you're going to want to add a freehand group and you're going to want to go and just make it as straight as possible. So basically what this does is it creates one side of what the shape is for the hair strand and it duplicates it on the other side so whatever shows up on this side shows up on the other side and we're just trying to make this into the strap of it so the way this is done right now this is fine i'll have to adjust this the thickness ratio though so once you hit the brush you're gonna have to do some more setting changes try to make it as straight as possible so those are fine and just make a little more of the interval but not too much Let's see how much it's able to actually go on the other side just try to even this out as much as possible You'll know it's straight by looking at the little line in between the dots. And try to have them as evenly out as possible. So this way you don't have some random like sharp edge in the middle of your headphones. Slightly over. Mm, no, not like that. Let's try to get more evened out. Now we're going to go and create the little, not sure, I can't remember what it's called, but it's a little puff balls around the ears. So just create another freehand group. Now this time we're going to adjust it to where it looks like a circle. that one as close to the middle as possible. Okay. All right. So and have the smoothness up. Uh, so one thing we're going to do with this one first before we finish off that is put on mirror. And just to so it goes slightly in. We're gonna go and have most of the headphones actually. 
covering the ears so it's not not to worry about the clipping This one, before we finish it off, a little bit out. Point 0.941, 1.03. Now for the brush. We're going to have point eight one. I feel like that's a bit too thick. We'll see how, yeah, it's a bit. That's good. All right, so going to adjust this like a circle. I'm just going to make a short little one. This way, if it only has one, um, if only has uh, two in total, then it stays pretty straight. If you put like three, then it starts doing some, it just looks bad. All right, so uh, we're just going to adjust this. And we're going to adjust the thickness of this. So let's click on the freehand group and just I feel like thickness might be too much. Do width. Yeah, we'll go with thickness. And we'll adjust it out a bit. No, not like that. can go and try to move it over so they're more evenly this one's more the one I'm worried about being evenly on the strap so you can use a position X to just kind of move it a little bit more right okay. 
This way they're more evenly together. A little more on the left, so not clipping. And adjust the width of them to be a little bit s smaller. There we go. So next thing we're going to do, we're going to change the texture of them. So in the material, just duplicate and we're going to change the base color to white along with the shade, the highlight, we're going to make it black. This way it's not showing up a different color than what the actual texture is. So this is the second material. The first material is her actual hair. So on the layer, import. And I have this texture in the description below. It's for free. So you can use it for this. Tog of visibility on the default image because we don't need that. This actually covers everything. And we're going to change this one to the second material, also. There you go. And that's how you create headphones in Vroy Studio. And because the headphones are actually on the head. It doesn't need to go through Unity to attach it to the correct body part. So when she's walking, it'll look fine, look like normal headphones. All right, so I ha hope everyone had an awesome day and learned something from this tutorial. If you did, um, hopefully like, subscribe. And have a lovely week.